Hey guys, it's Jose and I'm back for another BTS update video. It happened yet again, uh, but this, I don't know, but I think this has to be the worst that I've seen, uh, in my opinion. Um, maybe you've seen worse than this, but Jungkook was mobbed again at the airport from his arrival in, from LA. And he's back in Korea now. The blatant disrespect. Like, it's so clear that uh, these people that call themselves fans do not care for his safety. Just watch. Like the moment, the millisecond that he passes the line where the fans are, they break through and then they start mobbing him uh, to the point where he trips and almost falls. He clearly is telling them to please back up, to not do that. Uh, but he just gives up because it's like, well, it's not gonna happen. They're gonna keep doing what they feel like they wanna do. They walk in front of him. I, I I am appreciative of the bodyguards pushing them away, but I think at this point it's very important and I think it's necessary at the stage where BTS are at that they need something met more. Like either more bodyguards or like the National Guard. I w I'm not even exaggerating. They're at the point where they need that. Because I know that there's the alternative, which is like a private exit or a private entry and stuff like that like private jets or something like that but obviously they're not doing that so my only other solution to this is i mean i don't know the logistics of like airports and stuff like that so i'm not an expert but i mean the only other thing that i can think of is maximizing the security getting more bodyguards like i said the national guard like something where it's more secure or you know what better yet the airport should not allow this. The airport should not allow random people that aren't even taking flights to wait. Uh, maybe even the media, like, shut them down. Like, something needs to happen that's this extreme. Because if they don't, somebody will get injured. And they will be held liable. And I don't think the airports want that. There, Something has to change. Because it's it's really dangerous and it's also sad because this probably is the last time uh in one of his airport arrivals before he enlists in the military and then he's gonna remember this you know what i mean and still still even after all this he waves goodbye and blows kisses and is grateful and thankful even after he was completely disrespected um and i've gotten messages and i've seen them where uh people ask me like why are you sharing this we shouldn't be spreading this and the answer to that is because i want this to stop i'm hopeful that my channel has a reach um has an audience where it might change minds hopefully have a change of heart and don't do this and if that doesn't work we're calling it out that's the end goal of this to try and put a stop to this i don't know it's 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 sad uh it's frustrating I just hope he's okay, you know, like, and I know he is because he's strong. I know the guys are, but I don't know. I, I like they're human too. So I would, I would totally understand if, if this affects them in some way, you know, but yeah, <sighs> choose kindness guys. Um, love you. Love you, BTS. Let's, let's stay hopeful that this will change until next time guys. Adios. I'm a